G'day everyone, this is my Willesco D22, I'll take it for a run. I've just got the small Bix burner. This is I've found is quite ample for running this. Just pop that in there. I had it, you can hear it straight away starting to boil. I had it going a little bit before. Got that there for the drips. Put that away. Put a bit of oil in. One, two, three. One, two, three. I really like this engine. It's got a great sound to it. it reminds me of a diesel in idle. Great engine. Put these back on. Okay, the pressure's building up. Should be good to go pretty soon. Alright, take it for a spin. I love that idling sound it makes. I hope the camera's picking that up because it just sounds great. Okay, we'll take and get the chuff pot going. And we'll boost up the revs a bit. There's plenty of heat coming from that little Bix burner. That's the smallest Bix burner I think they make. And also the smallest bottle. But as you can see, there is plenty of heat coming from that little Bix burner. Oh, I love that sound. I've only run this probably, this is probably the fourth time I've run this and when I took it off the shelf today to run it, I had a look um, in the chimney and unfortunately the chimney was red, full of red rust and so was the little um, above the condensate bucket, the little black plastic condensate bucket that was they give with the D22. Um, that was rusty as well, so I've done a modification that I actually converted the tube so that the exhaust pipe comes out the side and now I can run it with a chuff pipe so there's no more condensate going to be in that press tin and um, I've got rid of that glass problem. So you've got a D22 or any of the other wheelchair ones that send the condensate and steam up the chimney, just have a look in there and just make sure that yours isn't rusting like mine is. Look at this again, we'll take this up this bit of speed on it.
just a nice engine. So well, let's go D22. There is something about seeing uh, twin cylinders go. All right. I'm going to take it up for one more bit of a blast. And uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Bye now.